we acquire a lot of knowledge when we are there in schools and then later in colleges but it is the application of the knowledge which is very very important and which consolidates or strengthens the knowledge that you have so you learn history and many of the times you would agree history is quite a boring subject but if we look at it from this perspective from the perspective of documenting it of understanding various small small features of these historical artifacts and then relate to it it becomes so much more interesting it actually teaches you how to observe any object which you see very very carefully how is this texture coming in there is this beautiful color here there are these interplay of different elements in there and we start to question why is the design like this why is it not like a conventional one why is the size so big what is it made of i think all these things should make you more curious this was a very great experience and i got to learn that my great grandparents all of them all four of them participated in the independence fight of india it was a time when my uh, great uh, great grandfather he used to escape from the police daily he used to come back to the house and my grandmother was crying saying that that her father used to escape from the police just for fighting for, uh, for the freedom it was a very emotional um, uh, con conversation and uh, it was very great i got to know many more facts about my family This is just a beginning you should do some things on yourself by yourself and build a library for your own school for your own colleges when you as you grow Sometimes our project couldn't be submitted so then we had to stay really late nights some of us were on the verge of giving up but then the others encouraged each other Something that I learned that is very important is mainly how to work as a team so before Uh, I wasn't that confident and mainly stayed back while my teammates were working sir. so by joining the e-hunter competition I have done to interact and uh, research equally with them take equal responsibility and I've done that we should never give up sir. as our projects got deleted but we never gave up and did our best Something that happens to us when we do this kind of project is that we begin to question everything so without you knowing it we are actually developing these characteristics in you and as soon as you start asking questions you become a better scientist you become a better engineer you become a better historian you become a better designer and you become a better person because you're always questioning what is the meaning of this how can i make it better right how do i do it differently and these kind of people are much more valuable in society the flat object how do you get the 3d of the object you could actually place very small things under it so that, so that the flat part is a little elevated so you can see the side of it so when you click a photograph this whole edge is highlighted and is differentiated from the back we improved a lot so regarding the subject it is like maybe it's uh, understanding about history or before and all he was not that interested in uh, history subject but now he he told me once that uh, if uh, there is any explanation in uh, school he can imagine visualize uh, the, the things it seems uh, that and uh, he is more outspoken now comparatively comparatively he is very very silent actually but now because of this exposure and all uh, his communication skills also got uh, improved up. every day uh, like they used to sit for 2 3 hours and then do more research work and then uh, blender was not actually in uh, inculcated in their syllabus and all but they have learned from the scratch uh, that how to use the blender and then many apps actually and they try, try to integrate uh, like all the subjects and then started going to the library and the whole personality of the students was changed here it is the stories that are very important for us it is the stories that set the narrative of our lives as such and you see history as a word has a story in there so don't take history as a boring subject look at the story part of it understand it learn it adopt it 
after this competition it has completely changed our perspective towards history at first uh, history was just a boring subject for us uh, rectifying all the dates we just wanted to score marks in it uh, so that our grades would improve at the end of the year but now uh, with this uh, project with this opportunity the virtual museum by e antra we are very grateful as it has made history more and more interesting for us we have understood what history really means it is to explore the uh, objects around us and know how they came into origin and use them in the future symbolic representation of uh, a power of nature which which in in buddhism translates into a spiritual power this um competition have uh, really improved our critical thinking if there is problem we just like i uh, look at it and like if we think we t- can't do it we just like leave it but then after like doing this process i think we have team to know how to find solutions for the problems and then look problems in different perspectives so that we can uh, find more ways to solve it